Hello, welcome to part two of my series on rebounds and rebounding. Today we're discussing five more telltale signs that the guy you are seeing could be rebounding. This is Mark, founder of Make Him Yours and creator of Find Love in Five Steps. I'll see you soon. All right, so we're back and we're chatting rebounds and I really wanna be comprehensive with this topic because it is so important. A rebounding guy can do a lot of damage because your feelings are going to be real and his may well not be. So I created a part two with another five telltale signs you need to know to protect yourself. The first one is he complains to you about her. This one's a dead giveaway and should really set off big alarm bells. A guy who's rebounding is a guy who's by definition stuck in the past. And there's no bigger sign he's stuck in the past than if he keeps referring back to the past to complain about his ex-girlfriend. I mean, once or twice in a conversation you initiate, sure, that's, that's gonna be normal. But any more than that, that guy is going to be rebounding. Number two, he's intense with his relationships, but then hesitates on commitment. So a guy who's rebounding wants fast closeness. He wants the companionship and the feelings of a relationship quickly. But when you actually try and make a relationship happen officially, he'll usually hesitate. He's got what he wants from you, he's got the feelings and they're supplementing for the short term what she gave him. Ultimately, he's not going to commit to you because in his mind, you're not her. Number three, he's always in relationships. So if the guy has a history of like bouncing from relationship to relationship and not being single for very long, it's a fair bet that he's doing the same thing again. Slow everything down. Number four is he tries to show you off on social media. So this is actually sort of the opposite of the guy I talked about before who hesitates on commitment. And it's a fair bit rarer. But sometimes a guy's in so much pain from his breakup that especially if she initiated it, so say it was out of the blue or if she cheated on him, he'll use you as a way to get back at her. So photos of the two of you on social media, even wanting to make your relationship Facebook official, men really hurt sometimes and they'll respond by trying to show the world how okay they are. Stay very casual, stay off social media with any guy who's had a recent breakup. Finally, number five, your gut tells you that if she called him wanting another shot, he'd say yes. If the person you're with is willing to up and leave you when a better option comes along, no matter who that option is, then that is not a person you should be with. Trust your instincts. Women have a far better read on this kind of thing than men do. If your instincts are telling you that he would leave you if she came back, then beat him to the punch and find someone who won't. So that's part two. Thank you so much for watching. If you haven't seen part one yet, I would definitely encourage you to do that. Link is up on my right here. Overall, I hope between these two videos, they, they gave you some clarity on how to spot a rebound and hopefully eased your mind with any guy you're seeing right now. Now remember, if you've seen any more than just a couple of these signs we've talked about, tread really carefully. Take time, months getting to know the guy, don't commit to him yet, wait for him to prove himself as boyfriend material who can meet your needs in a relationship. If you still have any doubts with this at all, and this can be a tricky one, lots of different situations possible, Either comment below, ask your question, or if you have something more detailed you want to ask, makehimyours.com.au forward slash coaching in the top right corner. We can chat one-on-one -on -one about your situation. So that's it. Thank you so much for watching. Subscribe to the channel, and I look forward to seeing you in the next video.